Chest tricks are often used when no ballistic protection is needed. Or when ballistic protection is needed, you can use a blade carrier or a ballistic vest and wear a chest trick over it. Today I want to show you this chest trick. This chest trick is by the German company Lindenhof Taktik and from the width it's relatively wide with the accessory pouches, but it still fits well with a big backpack. Most pouches are permanently attached, but you also have some laser cut webbing to attach additional pouches. Let's start on the side. Here's one of two utility pouches. I mark this with a cross. Inside here is my IFAC and some survival gear. Just have to open it here and then inside here is again something red, easy to find. And this gives me full access to my IFAC. Scissors, tourniquet, and then there are four of these main magazine pouches, which are all the same. They have some webbing to attach molly pouches on both sides. I attached this double pistol magazine pouch in front. And here just some monocular to do some spotting. And now let's talk about these pouches. They have a flap. The flap also has got some webbing and velcro, so you can shorten it or just place it behind the chest rig. So now I would have open pouches. You can see inside there two G36 magazines fit inside and between them is a spacer with some stiff material. There's elastic cord to tighten it, so you can pull it tight and then I can run around with these mags open if I have to do some yeah, direct action, for example, or if I only have one magazine inside, I can even pull it tighter and I can run with four open magazines or yeah, do some other things with it. For example, the German smoke grenade. The big one also fits inside here. On this side I added a Grimlock carabiner, so if I don't wear my helmet I can for example clip it here so I don't have to hold it in my hand. Then right here is also a dump pouch by Lindenhof Taktik. This is a super compact, super lightweight one. Just like an Alibi dump pouch, if needed, I can dump some magazines or put some loose rounds in here. Yeah, really handy. And when stored away or stowed away, it's super compact and doesn't annoy. And then again, one of these utility pouches. Inside here, I can have my communication some saw and scissors for tricks, weapon maintenance kit, and so on. You can see it's accessible since I can rotate the rig a bit. But for better access, I prefer to use these pockets or a smock with pockets around here, or I just add a hip belt. What I do when I don't have my pistol on my waist, I sometimes just dump this magazine and put a pistol in here and secure it with this webbing. This webbing can be adjusted on the inside so I can fit the proper length. You can see in front there is a special buckle from Lindenhof Taktik. It can be open and closed almost silently. Just have to pull the stockel and it opens the front. On the inside, there is some hook, hook velcro, which is covered up with some loop velcro. So if you wear this over a plate carrier, for example, this will avoid the rig to slip and rub too much. Yeah. The big advantage of a split front chest rig is it's super easy to get in 
and out. And when you go prone and lay down, you can just open it and it's more comfortable than when you have to lay on these pouches. What I like about the Chesswick is it's not too modular. It's relatively lightweight, it's comfortable, and it can work with four magazines, it can work with eight magazines or three magazines and a pistol, six magazines and a pistol. These big double magazine pouches even fit the German big smoke grenade. So it gives good options with only these four magazine pouches. Small things can be added with Molly and the utility pouches are also quite nice and big. Inside there is loop velcro and elastic loops so you can secure the content and yeah since I own this chest rig I really like it and I stick with it. It's a really nice one. That's it with the video. Make sure to leave a comment what chest rig you are using. Give me a thumbs up if you like, subscribe if you want and I'm looking forward to be watched by you again if you like. Check out my other videos. Bye!